I want to address something you may be hearing some talk about. It's the idea that institutional investors are buying up all the houses. While investors are buying up some homes, the vast majority are not owned by investors. And even the ones that are, aren't the type of investors you may expect. This chart shows who owns all the single family rentals. There are four main types of investors. I want to focus on two right now. First, look at the green. It shows that 80% of rentals are owned by mom and pop investors. Savvy people like you and I. They bought a second home or they chose to rent their last home instead of selling it when they moved. We see a lot of that because folks are reluctant to sell when they have a 3% mortgage. Now look at the red. Those are those large institutional investors you've been hearing about. They only make up about 3% of investor-owned properties. That's a big difference, right? I know there's a lot of chatter about large firms buying up all the houses, but that just isn't what the data shows. Most investors are people like you and me. As your local expert, I can help you separate fact from fiction right here in our market.